Most people in life are looking for how do I make a life worth living in return with having. Well, you do this by learning to serve people. We all generally learn this in our life. That if we haven't figured out how to serve people, then we don't know how to sell ourselves to a company for employment. And at the same time, if we fail to serve people based on our own immoralness, our own attitudes, our own arrogance, we tend to piss people off, and that produces for us complaints about our performance or our productivity. Productivity is definitely where it's at today, that companies do thrive on the productivity of their employees. But in life, we also have to recognize that we are responsible for what we say and what we do. And sometimes companies that are launching young people into their employment don't think about that they're launching those children's careers outside of just a body to fill a job. If we're trying to launch a young person into being a long-term employee that doesn't time out, doesn't get bored, doesn't quit because the work is hard, we have to give them a philosophy of our industry that makes the most sense to everyone in the world and we also have to use the language of marketing that will really shove it home through their little pea brain minds that don't get things that well and that can be influenced by immoral children around their life. Now I don't mean to be insolent and I don't mean to be indifferent and I don't mean to be arrogant and I don't mean to be an elitist but I have to say this we really have to be protecting the right of young people to be employed but the only way to do that is to make sure we get a sense of where they come from what they've been through what their parents do for making a living so that we can help them to achieve the most we can have them do within our workplaces so if I'm training someone for example in the food industry I'm going to begin with something really common sense to make the child feel or the young adult feel or that new person out of college feel really like they understand something so I might say most people are aware that we need to eat every single day and everybody knows that typically most people eat three to six meals a day and because of that we have the great opportunity as a representative of our company to help people find our food and our culinary skills and the quality of what we offer in this restaurant to help them choose us over the competition. Now how that translates to you is that it keeps you employed. How that relates to me is that it keeps me funded for my family. So what I'm going to ask you right now is why are you working? What are you working for? What's the money that you're going to be earning in our company going to be used for? Please make your dream list and write it down for me. So that I'm really aware of what's important to you. Because as a company we offer a lot of benefits. And if at some point something on your list comes across my desk as an opportunity, I might like to pass it along to you because you've been a good quality employee.